that something I forgot. Forgot where? Uh, there's something I need to buy for the family. Let oh. me just buy it somewhere here. Okay? But at least you should have just driven us in. You can't leave us here. Don't worry, just you keep moving, okay? Once the gate opens, just go in. Okay? Okay, just don't be long. Let me start going. Um, oh, come on, come on, baby. Mm. Mm. Daddy loves you. Mm. Daddy loves you. Don't stay long. Let me see. You're gonna pull my head. <laughs> okay. Let me see. Be, be quick. Okay, I'm coming. All right. Sit down properly. Good evening. Good evening, ma. And I'm your AP. Um, I'm actually on my way to this house, but my husband went to get something, so I have to wait for him. Okay. But even at that, you can't just block the road like this. Okay, can I come in? This is the palace of a very, very powerful king. Oh. You understand that? Okay, can I come in there? Driving at once. Thank you. What's going on? Um, my Why not allow them coming before you start throwing your questions at them? That's exactly what I'm doing. So go ahead and do my it. Name. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. I'm so sorry about the way he behaved. He was just doing his job. Oh, okay. Yes. Please, I, who, who are you and how may I help you? My name is Queen Esther Wakaka, the Queen of Womodina Kingdom. Okay, who are you? My name is Rebecca and my husband is Prince Obin Naokaka. Um, these are my kids. He actually went to get something down the road. He said he would be back and we decided to just come in ourselves. Your husband is who? Prince Obinna. Are you standing there? Can you help me? Get the car key! Get the car key! Forgive me! 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 For
Day was not natural. It wasn't normal. It was an accident. No. Were you not there? Mm. I didn't see the king pull the trigger. That is why it's an accident. No. It has never been heard of that a king of a kingdom killed his own prince. The heir apparent to his throne. Wait. Are you saying the prince is dead? No, no. Let's praise her life. Let's praise her life. In times like this, we need to be very strong. God knows the best. We did all we could, but the prince could not make it. Your Majesty! Loss! Your Majesty! Your Majesty! My brother, I mean, uh, nobody go out of this gate without your knowledge. Tell me, where are my parents and my brother? Um, my princess, they all went to the hospital. Hospital? To do what? My princess, the king mistaken shot the prince. How do you mean my father mistaken shot my brother? How? What happened? How did it happen? My princess, take it. It was, it was an accident. <gasps> accident? Please, please, my princess. 
you are just coming from a very far journey. Why not rest a little bit? With time, you will understand everything. Please. No, please talk to me. It was, it was a mistake. Oh God, I'm not getting this whole thing. What happened? My talk to me. He says you need to calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Okay. Which hospital? Which hospital did they go to? The family hospital. That's the the general hospital. We don't go there, no princess. <laughs> wait, wait. Yes, Your Majesty. He's fine. He's just in shock over what happened. What's going on here? Please, my brother, I'll be now. Just calm down. He's not here now. He's not here. No, no, someone should tell me to lie, please. Please, princess, put yourself together. It's no good for the king, you know. Doctor, I think we've had enough for the day. I hope my husband is going to be fine. I assure you, your majesty, the king will be fine. Just that he tried to swallow everything as a man. But he'll be okay. How about a wine? That's a wine. Okay, wine. As an ada bucket, would you find out a hollow? Ada bucket, Jebes. Educa Moji Ojo Baleno, Webia. I am here once again to seek your face as a wine. I did not come empty handed. I present these cooler notes before your face to consult you. I have never and will never perform whatever due sacrifice that you demand from me. Please, answer me. As and why, please, answer me. As and why, I greet you. I greet you. You're welcome, my son. My son, what brought you from this part to me this hot afternoon? As am I. My king has lost his son. What must be done? You shall go to the three-part junction. An egg is going to appear before you. Take it. Shall be done as to the bear. Go! Take the egg by your side.
as a more as a more as I break this egg every power you possess shall scatter as this egg scatter on this junction any power you serve any power that serves you shall scatter it shall scatter <laughs> Asum kona mesuka, eh? Asamu, this is for you. It can never come back to me. Eh? Asum God. Mhm. Oti to deligeso. Your Highness, all I'm seeing is a natural cause. Nobody programmed anything. It, it was just an accident. for me to bear. But there's no amount of sweet words that can bring Obina back. What do you want me to do? Just calm down. Okay. What do you want me to say? Okay, Just help me and wake him up. <laughs> Mother, please, God, and wake him up for me. Wake him. Please, you want yourself. No. Please, let's lift our Come. No, my heart is bleeding. My heart is bleeding now. I can't take it. Are you? No, no, you want to separate me from me. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't want to leave you. It's okay. No. Just try and calm yourself down. Please. We all know he was close to you more than anyone in this palace. Please, like it. What do you mean? What do you mean, my father's shoe? What if you are his sister or mother? Please, it's okay. 
Do you know who wish to pay for all what we are passing through in this palace every second? No, 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 leave me. No. No. Ma'am, there's something that is bothering me since you think it's affected you, I, I don't know, to help him looking. Just of your son's death. And what might that be? Um, which one are the angel? Do I'm not in position with any truth, mm. but the think think that the art might have someone who want to take over his throne. Um, Chief Fumse, huh? I told you this. There's a death number. That there's issues that are not supposed to be discussed in the open. Trees have ears. Walls have ears. So what? By the song we are listening to us. You know that I'm not going to take the throne. But all I'm saying is that sooner or later, all the cabinet chiefs will know what is going on. And they will feel bad about it. Let us be going home first. Say, eh? When we get home, we can discuss this in your house or in mine. This world may have ears, like oh, your own world or my own world. Mm. Anybody can listen. That is not my own cup of tea. But all I'm saying is that that can never deprive me to say what I want to say. Anytime, anywhere. Mark it. Mm. Hey. Um. Mazudeno. Oh no. All I am asking is for you to lease half of your acres of land to me. Eh? I want to make use of that land next year for farming. Don't worry about the payment. I am going to pay you well. Very well. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Yes. Are you talking about my land at the uh, EC Dida? That is what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it that you don't always like to go to a place where we don't benefit? Why? You only like to go to a place where you win. You go there, you win. You go there, you win. What? <laughs> um, I have told you already. The land at Isindita is what I am asking of. Oh. And when you <laughs> make reference about me going to places that profits me, you should understand that Onuru is a man that is created to win. You should know you know. I was not born to be counting trees and houses no i am made properly to live and live well happily um <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway mm -hmm. um can you afford to pay for the land i know you are not lacking financially you are not lacking your financial calculation is very balanced but you know that land is very large and very, very fertile. Uh, Mazude, initially you were talking as if you don't like money. But now you've started speaking like <laughs> a man that loves the taste of money, just like you all know. <laughs> I, like I said earlier, I will pay you handsomely. Don't worry. Eh? go Oh no. I trust what you can do. I know you have the financial capability. I trust you. You know I'm not demanding for all, just half. Uh, 
very, very sweet. <laughs> Is it the one along the farm road? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's always very sweet. You plug it, Mama. You climb up. I have, <laughs> I have something to say. You see, we'll be making a lot of money from Onowu this season. As you all know, it's interested in this is our land at Isindeda. <laughs> mm. Why are you not saying anything? Ugo? Or you're not interested in what I said? The mama. The business is good. Just that the man that you are doing the business with is one we don't like. Why? Is it because of what happened in the past? Let us forget the past. This is strictly business. Father, we do respect. We do respect, Father. This can never be in the past. You sounded as if you have forgotten all that he did. This is a man who fought tooth and nail to ensure that you are not included in the king's cabinet. And not now. You are not. Father, I am old enough to recognize an evil man when I see one. Look, 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 look. It's okay, my son. It's okay. You see, um, why don't we learn to forget the past? Like I told you, it's strictly business. It's not on a friendly basis or anything we call it. Father, I bet you disagree with you. This can't be business. This just cannot be business. My husband. Our son is not lying. Oh, because I gave you. Oh, has the characteristics of an evil man. <coughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. What are these stories for? I said what I said. Father, we are sorry for God to offend it. But. Why is it that my father cannot take a simple advice when he is giving you? That's your father. Yeah? Mommy, as you just said, this man has the characteristics of an evil man. That's him. Oh no, he is a demon. That man he is a demon. He knows this. Eh? Why can't your father understand this? Here! Yeah. Hey. You just say this man has the characteristics of an evil man. Nay, let me run along and get the leaves in the bush as you requested. Ugo, why no? Please sit down. There is something I want to discuss with you. Okay. I have been experiencing some changes within me for some time now. What type of changes, my husband? The gods. I no longer hear from the gods. I no longer see what the gods are showing me. I don't have to I'm not saying this. I have been in darkness for some time now. My, what happened? Are you sure someone has not cast a spell on you? Spell? No one has the power to cast a spell on me. Throughout this kingdom, and even within our neighboring kingdoms, not even one person. Anyway, the last time I checked on the gods, I am still being favored by the gods. I must all. What do we call this now? We are in a serious danger and open to any form of attack. No. No. Hi. No one dares it. I mean, no one can dare it. Because no one knows. What do you mean? I have been doing this since I'm doing with my own ideas and experiences. That is all. What if you make a mistake and someone finds out? Then you come again. Don't worry yourself. 
I am still the chief priest of this land. The Ojena Mo Ojena Mari of this land. The Afun Ife Afun Anzuzu of this land. Yeah. Don't worry yourself. Very soon I will find out whoever is behind all this. Uh, may the gods forgive me because uh, if I get me, I, I just have to uh, plead with the gods in advance. May the gods forgive me for the evil I'm about to commit. Because if eventually I discover whoever is behind all this, hey, the entire family is going to be wiped out. What's up? Hey. Hey. Nine. Okay. I'm coming. Let me go and get the leaves. Go. Go. Oh no. From the east to the to the south is 250 feet. Why the north is about 200 and some few feet. Then down this way to the west. We'll go. Are you alright? Is that not your son? Please don't mind him. Maybe he's trapped. No, no. No, maybe he's trying to not get any meat today. <coughs> Please, let's forget about him. <laughs> well, I've seen this place and I believe I, I like it. Um, this is the kind of things I love to invest money on. Well, you asked for the money. Um, the money is available already. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I know what you can do. <laughs> um, we have to go to my house so that you can have the money. But um, I want to ask. The document covering this transaction between me and you which both of us must endorse before I hand over the money to you. Are they ready? Look, don't you trust me? The documents are ready. Both the new, the old, the ancient, they are just ready. <laughs> what we need to do is just go home and sign the dotted line. And the line becomes yours after giving me the money. <laughs> mm. Let's go. <laughs> Let us go. <laughs> Ah, hey. Romeo, hmm? I trust what you can do. son I want you to move on with your life this is the right time for you I know you can't keep hanging on like that you're a beautiful girl with a bright future mother no no there is no bright future without the price no listen listen 
I saw the three well-to-do and handsome men you showed me. I saw them at the burial. All I am asking you to do is to choose one out of them and move on with your life. Whatever has happened, has happened. And such is life. Listen to me, please. Mother, please. I'm begging you. Please don't chase me away. Don't. Please. Anytime I come to this house and go to his room, I feel his presence around me and I feel more comfortable. Please, I'm begging you. I'll be fine. Don't chase me away. I'm begging you, please. Madonna, I'm not chasing you away. What you are doing right now is that you're causing more harm on yourself and it's not proper. What I am trying to do is what every good mother will do. Choose a man, settle down and live your life. <laughs> no, no. Hey, Dona, listen, listen to me. Listen to me. <laughs> Wherever my son is, he will know that you meant well for him. And you will even hear his voice telling you to move on. <laughs> no, no, I can't. I can't. This thing is too much. I can't do it. No. You can't. It's too much. No, 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 you can't. Listen to me. You can do it. No, no. No, listen to me. I'm a mother. No, no, no. Please. All I'm asking you to do is to move on with your life. You can't keep doing this to yourself. No. It's okay. It's okay. Please, please. I don't know you can do this. You can do this for yourself. It's for your own good. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Madonna's mother is in trouble. For what? Is Madonna okay? They say they've not seen her since the last time she came here. Meaning what? After I advised her to move on with her life, Amanda said she came to her room. Yes, father. I told her that mother's advice is the right thing she has to do. I even got food. We ate together. I escorted her out. Have they searched for her everywhere around here? And I'm sure that this was the last place she left. Her mother said she had a phone conversation with her. And she said she was tired that everyone should leave her alone. Go and call her mother, Amanda. Yes, father.
What are you doing here? And how did you find me here? I should be the one asking you that. What are you doing in this lonely place? Do you know what time it is now? You made your parents worried. We are all worried. We have been looking for you everywhere. Where is my phone? I can't find it. it all. It's at the palace. I miss him so much. I can't see at the bed. This is why I came here. At least let me see him. If I can see him. I'm sorry. I want to see him. Let's go. Okay? Yes. You need to let go. Really? It's okay, please. Stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. Please. Let's go. Please. You know, you're a very good man. I know. A very, very good man. But uh, if you allow me to advise you, you see, it will be good for you to allow the gods to take their own course and play everything by their own way. <clears throat> no, oh no, no. <laughs> you see, I understand your fear. But let me make it clear to you that when I become the king of our people very soon, of which you know my family is the rightful owner of that kingship, I shall retain you as the owner <laughs> because you are also a very good man. As <laughs> you <laughs> This is a handshake from Ono to you. Hmm? Very good. You see, I appreciate. Thanks for the compliment. You always appreciate me. Yes. I know. <laughs> you see, the the manner you spoke, I really don't think is right. Mm. Yes, it could mean well personally to you. But you see, our Igwe is still alive. <laughs> still sitting on the throne. <laughs> Except you are wishing him dead so soon, or maybe you have other plans. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Mm. The language of our elders are the language of wisdom. You are correct. The God forbid, no one's blood is worth that throne. <sighs> no, I'm only talking for tomorrow, mm. not today. Now you are beginning to make sense. It is getting clearer to me now. Because uh, the manner you spoke, I have started watching you from the corner of my mm -hmm. eyes already. <laughs> <laughs> no. The gods forbid that I dream such dream. Uh, you see, even though if I don't become king, my son is still very young. He'll be there. I am not in a hurry. I am <laughs> never in a hurry. <laughs> As you rightly said, the words of the elders are words of wisdom. Exactly. You just made the same statement now. You've spoken as a wise man. Yes. Mm. So let's continue with our mm. drink. <laughs> Hi. <clears throat> what is it? Are you... Um, you want to leave? <laughs> 
ah, you see, I, I am headed to another place before getting home. Um, let me reserve some space because I know there will be a lot to drink and eat over there. Uh, so well, let me not fill all the space in my stool. <laughs> well, as you did, you want to abandon your drink? No, I'm not abandoning it. I've taken a mouth in Onowo's house. Let me try the next door. There is a lot to drink and eat today. Ah, it's all right. I will see you off. But however, <laughs> uh, when it is my turn to entertain, you eat and take home. <laughs> <laughs> Let's wait for that uh -huh. day. <laughs> uh, so let me run along. <laughs> Let's take him home. Lift him. 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 Let's go. Hey. Let's go. Hey. Let's go. Let's go. My father. Hey, don't leave my father. Hey. I want to eat now. What do we do? Hey. Okay, let's, 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 Papa, Papa, don't do this to me now. Eh? Papa, talk to me. Tell me. What, what did you eat? Eh? Papa, what, what, what did you drink? Mama! Mama! Papa, talk to me. Papa, talk to me. Papa, talk to me. Eh? Papa, talk to me. Papa, talk to me. Eh? What did you eat? Eh? Papa, talk to me.
Igwe. Oh no. Do you know if mistakenly Mazu Denu died in my house? <laughs> there is no way I would have denied not knowing what killed him because both of us ate and drank in my house. Eh? Chimubanya. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Eh? Indeed. I thank the gods that I did not go any further to pursue the matter that I had with him before. Everyone will say that I killed him so that he won't be a threat to my throne. Igwe, you are right. And uh, if we should look deeper, his son is still alive and vibrant. I think he is even the one that is a threat to the throne, Igwe. Oh no, huh? it will be too late before anyone will come to think about that. Ah. Yes. I will. I am sorry for their loss, though. Mm -hmm. I heard that uh, the son and Mazudenu's wife, that they are doing everything. They are going all out to find out the cause of Mazudenu's death. They better do it quickly. They have my total support. Okay? I will send another guard to go and disseminate the information. <laughs> oh no. Igwe, that's why we talk about you in this our <laughs> land. Eh? You are oh no, very no. Now in Bewo. Uh huh. Um, how are you? I'm fine. Uh, where to? The king sent me uh, to deliver a message to Mazude's wife. Oh, you are heading to Uday's family? Yes. No, no. Uh, let me join you then. Let me join you. Okay. Let's go together. Okay. How is the king? Yeah, the king is doing very well. Okay. Yes, that's what you said. Yeah, thank you. I guess they should be at home. Very safe. Um, the Igwe sent for him. The uh, king? Yes. Yes, yes, ma'am. The king said um, your son will go should come to the palace later in the day to come and collect the remaining money he promised to people. Okay. And they should also not delay to come to the palace with anything that you may need. Ah, I should come to the palace later in the day? Yes. Please thank him for us. Eh? Uh, do our come. You heard him. Thank you very much, ma'am. Um, both of you may be wondering why I came with him. I was on my way to the palace when I saw him coming here. So I decided to come with him. Eh? In as much as uh, it took both of you time to accept the gift I brought. I mean the foodstuffs and the money. But um, as soon as I live here and I get home, you are going to hear from me again. <laughs> Thank you so much. You are welcome. You are welcome. Just try and understand us, please. I, I do. I do. Oh, no. Thank you very much. It's all right. Very much. Thank you. It's all right. Such a kind man. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so let's be on our way now. Okay. No. No. Just okay. Let me see. Uh, uh, don't bother. Just don't bother. No. No. Let me see you before. Don't bother. We know our way out. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Okay. Eh? Take care of Bye. yourself. <laughs>
are your next plans after this? Hmm. My plan depends on what happened if you just died. Okay, good. I will advise you to go and fortify yourself in case of any other thing. Why? My husband, the chief priest, thinks that someone evil is after your family. Someone after my family? Over what? Stop acting like a child. Don't you know someone may hate you just for no reason? Someone may try to take you away just because of your happiness, your contentness in life, even your son that is doing well in business. You're making me scared. Okay. The mysterious death of your husband is only enough for you to know that someone evil is after your family. That is why I and my son wants to know what happened. My dear, work off. They say prevention is better than cure. Save your only calm before going out to inquire the reason of the other lost. And if you think the chief priest wants you to give him money, no, he wants to do it free. So make haste by the first chance to up on me. Because, for the back, oh?
do not know why all of you don't want to listen to me. This is the fifth time, and the gods are still saying the same thing. Mazu Udeenu and his family were the people that brought their own death upon themselves because they went in search of power in order to overthrow the throne. To fear that abomination in the sight of the gods. <laughs> Chief Priest, why are you in a hurry to leave? I do not know when you people started doubting me. All of you! To the extent that I had to console the gods five good times on one issue. But well, if you people don't believe me anymore, Your Highness, you can send some of our cabinet chiefs to all these neighboring kingdoms. And then console these small, small native doctors who are very, very sure and great at that. Your Majesty, I am worried. I wonder why the chief priest is talking to us in this manner. I don't know if you did notice. He is beginning to act strange lately. Listen, even if he's arrogant, not in this palace. Or in our presence. Your Highness, if you will permit me, let us travel to other kingdoms and consult other chiefs. We might get something different. <laughs> the chief priest is greater than them all. It's like leaving the elders to ask about our tradition in the hands of young men. With due respect, Your Majesty. There is sense in what he just said. There is no harm in trial. You can never tell. I don't just believe in this whole story. The shock has not left me. Is it? Imagine, imagine the king and the cabinet chiefs turning me around like a child, asking me useless questions, questions upon questions upon questions, useless questions. But did you tell them what we discussed here? Why should I? Why should I tell them? When well, they were busy asking me questions upon questions, asking me questions, asking me to keep consulting the ghosts over and over and over. Concerning one thing, just one thing. What we are they asking? Can you actually do that in mind? They were asking me of what went wrong with the Udenu family. That is all. Good. That is when you should drop the Obini way. Did you? Hi, man. I couldn't. I, I couldn't remember anything. I couldn't remember anything. I, I, I decided to conclude the matter by telling them that the Udeno family were the people that actually brought death upon themselves because they went in search of power in order to overthrow the truth. Hey! I'm at your heart. Who has done this to my husband? The 
eyes, the ear, the mouth of the gods. My. How are you? Fine. You come closer. Come closer. Come closer. And how is your husband, the chief priest? He is fine, I know. I'm not talking about his health status. I'm talking about his relationship with the gods. How is he communicating with the gods? Oh no, we. You sounded as if you have become the chief priest. And the gods have told you that they are not in good terms with my husband. Ogumanya, I only asked a simple question because your husband has started leaving trails of words that are questionable even to laymen like us. You know what I'm talking about. I will advise you talk with him and find out how he is faring. Yes, before it becomes late. <laughs> better take to my advice. Talk with him. Find out his situation. It may get late. Oh no, who? Oh, chop my day, chop on his yahoo. Man, you chop on his yahoo, eh? I can't believe him, man. My daughter. Okay. Don't worry by tomorrow. Yeah, it will be concluded. It's okay. Hold on, I'll call you back. Good day, Gina. How are you? I thought I've warned you to stop calling me handsome. Please. If you like to get a court order or an army man to shoot up anyone that calls you handsome. But you know what I want to do? I'll be so glad to shout it and be shot dead with hands on in my mouth. Then you must be crazy. <laughs> Are you just finding out? Come on, Obina. It is not your fault that you're handsome. You should all thank God for that. Anyway, I brought you something good for lunch. Um, thank you very much. You can now go to your office because someone might walk in here. No problems. I'll walk to you anyway. Enjoy. Thank you. Ah. What is going on? What is wrong with women? I can't even concentrate to do my job. To you? I heard you said something to me as I was Um, Joy, with my lips, I wasn't talking to you. <laughs> you should have said, kiss my lips. That would have been better. <laughs> you seem to be thinking that you're in a wonderland. But I guess you wake up from your dream. I would love to be in that kind of dream. Like forever. I would want to wake up again. 
Anyway, I have something nice for you. I know you will like it. Um, thank you very much. So, can I do my job now? As you can see, I have a lot to do. Is that all you have to say? Oh, maybe... I'll stand up and come and give you a hug. <laughs> or, better off, I pay you for the food you bought for me. Oh, come on, Obina, don't insult me. What's that? I think I better lock my door. I better lock. I better lock my door. Sorry, good day, Ozzy. Going somewhere? That's it. None of your business. I decided to bring this food because I feel you might be hungry. Oh, as usual. Yeah, as usual. I'll be in my office. <laughs> oh God. Yes, come on in. Man, what's up? What up? Man, I'm good. Are we having a birthday party? Not really birthday. Bazaar. I call it bazaar. <laughs> What is really going on? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Hey, come on, sit down. I think I'm having bazaar here. Bro, what is going on? As you can see. So why are you not doing justice to them? You are the master of food, so you can go on and start having them. I know exactly where this thing is coming from. Then you find something. When I look at the shape of the food, I will know who is who. This must be Jenna. Because you are in trouble, man. You are in trouble. Aha! This is John. Because I know the shape of step food. You know what it comes with? Food pack. Wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you. Why are you licking, why are you licking your lips and swallowing it? So it, like... it is only a stupid man. That will not lick his lips when he sees food. <laughs> but come to think of it, if you don't want to eat, I can do justice to it. And if you don't want me to eat it, So, what I heard about you and women is true. What you heard about me and women? Okay, sorry. Let me rephrase. What I heard about how women throw leap around you is true. Fair enough.
How do you cope with all this drama and you're able to concentrate on work? I don't know, but I just thank God, you know, my work is important. I focus on my work. My work, very important. Never mind. So, how is that? Um, Um, so, Amani, who's this new guy in the office that every girl seems to be frolicking around? Mm. Obinna, uh. a very hard working young man. A young man with precision. Uh -huh. A young man with accuracy. In fact, if you take your time properly, you will love to stay with that young man. And he's handsome, can we add? You already have his picture. No, 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 no. I've just done a background check on him. It's just that I don't have much to work with and I was hoping that she would give me that information. A background check on him? I don't really get it. Why is it that everybody come to me with this rhetoric question? I call it rhetoric because I don't even know how to answer it. I don't really know. Is there anything you are really trying to dig out? Uh, no, no, not much. I just wanted to know more, a little bit more about him. But it's fine. If you don't know anything. Thank you for the drink. If you are here to drink, make use of the other table. Why? You don't want us to share a table, but you want us to share one man. What's the matter with that baby girl? Sorry, my dear. I am here to drink and enjoy myself. Oh. Not to talk about a man. <laughs> okay? And frankly, I am here to see you so we can talk about him. What do you want? <laughs> Excuse me. Hold on. You don't ask me what I want like he's your man. For what I know, not even Steph has had a kiss from him. Oh. Yes. So what's your point? Well, my point. I think it can actually work for us if we can agree. Hmm? For us? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, dear. There is nothing like us. <laughs> in this game. Please, Joy. Let me land, okay? No, 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 no. Keep flying. <laughs> Fly. Well, girlfriend, haven't it occurred to you that the same man we are after is giving more time, attention, and affection to Steph? You know, if we can work together, knock off Steph, we stand a chance of having him to ourselves. <laughs> Sorry, my dear colleague. I said it before, mm. and I'm saying it again. There is nothing like us in this game. Okay. All ladies in their own league. <laughs> you see what I was telling you? It's the way she carries herself. Because Obina gives her more affection. That is why we have to work together and make sure she's out of it forever. Who 
Come on, Joy. It is not too much. We have to do something about this. We really have to work together. yourself with alcohol. It won't help you. Let us take her out. What is going on? The dog. This is up to six. I was I was very shocked when you called me and said you're still in the office working. Yeah. By this six o'clock, a human being created by God. Bros, you are going to break down if you don't take time. Pack all these things, let us go. Dr. Manny, I am not going to break down. And I will never break down. Okay? And after all, it's not that late. You are giving me this impression that you are something else. Mm -hmm. Having no accuracy, precision and calculation in everything you do, I am beginning to wonder that something is wrong somewhere. You better pack this things, let us go. Leave your breath now. Let us go. Okay, okay, okay. You win. Okay? Mm -hmm. But just give me a little time. Let me round up one or two things and, you know. So that you can pack this workload to the house? <laughs> no, I will not allow that. Let us go. Please, let us go. You know one thing, I just, I just love working, just love it. Amani hates working. You are the only one that loves working. I never said so. Elizima. I never said so. Nah, boss, <laughs> boss, 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 let's go. I walk, I walk, I walk. <sighs> let's go, back, back. Are you not packing my files for me? Uh, if I don't pack it now, nah, probably it will break down one door. I already packed my files for uh, me. Let me pack them tomorrow. Before <laughs> uh, Um, Dr. Money, uh, please, right now the network is very bad. But I want you to believe me that tomorrow, I must definitely transfer the money to you. Yeah, sure. I, I believe you, you know, everything you do is all about being perfect. Definitely, I'm going to see that light in the morning. Okay. Thank you for trusting me. Uh, no, no problem. It's, it's nothing. All right. Um, I need to, I need to make a shift. I have a presentation, a kind of lecture, a kind of smart thing to. I want to deliver. Don't, don't, tell, don't tell me you're leaving. 
I'll see you. I'll see you. Okay, bro. You take care. Uh, Alright, see you then. Yeah, see you. <laughs> OB. <laughs> OB. Steph, what is it? What is it? Stop this. Okay? Please. What, what do you mean? Are you not a man? Tell me that you don't have feelings for a woman. See, I I do, okay? But what you want me to do, I I, I cannot. Oh, dear. oh, dear. oh dear. Ah, Steph, Steph, come on, come on, come on, stop it, stop it. Stop it, stop it. Please, please, okay, 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 okay. Listen, listen, Steph. Just join your plot, okay? See, listen to me. Listen to me. Step. Come on. Don't do this. Please. Mm -hmm. See, I, I I want to tell you. Listen, just listen, okay? I like you. You're beautiful. You're awesome. You are highly endowed. Any man that sees you this one and the floor for you, that man is crazy. But, but what do you want me to do? I cannot. Okay? Please. Please. Put yourself together. B, why are you hurting me? What have I done? B, am I not sexy? Am I not good looking? Uh, I'm, I'm Steph, listen. You're, you're highly sexy. You're beautiful. You're like lollipop. You're licking, licky, licky. But let the truth be told. Just put yourself together and and get over this. Okay? Please. Please. something baby girl <laughs> girls you won't believe what happened could you believe that he totally refused me and even threatened to throw me out of the house when I tried to seduce him <laughs> yeah. and why is it nothing to women or what? No. <laughs> no. I hope it's not what I'm thinking what are you thinking? Like, is he a homosexual? Oh, God forbid. Why do you do anything like that? Because I don't understand why any man on earth would refuse beautiful ladies like us. I don't, I don't get it. Well, you know, I've actually monitored his moves for like a month plus to know if he has a girl out there or something. And I found no. As a matter of fact, his only friend in this town happens to be Amani. Uh -huh. <laughs> Are you saying that Amani is a biosexual? <laughs> Please. Not at least. Come on, I know Amani is very good in bed. Hmm? What? Oh, please, Joy. She thinks I don't know about her affairs with him. Uh, no, 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 no. I am not denying the fact that I had an affair with Amani. But I'm actually surprised at you. I remember they said something like, I will never and never have an affair with a colleague or a co worker. Yes, I said that. Not when you kept on pressing with great gifts and all that stuff. This is girl. I needed a fresh start from that idiot guy I was dating. Um, please. Enough, girls. Enough. Please. Let's go back to the topic that brought us here. Are you trying to say that Obi and Amani die bisexual? I don't, I don't get it. 
I just hope it's not what you're thinking, <laughs> but that's the same. Uh, Dr. Mani, the truth is that I, I don't like what you did that day. You made me look like a fool. But I've, I've asked you for forgiveness many times, time without number. I don't know why you are still repeating this issue. What I did for you that day is not something bad. I don't have any bad intention towards it. I did it for you so that you could have somebody who could take care of you, especially after work. But the way you are sounding me, it seems to see if I have committed, even at that, I'm, I'm so sorry, once again. Not that, just that I choose to live my life and how I like to live it. It is alright, once again I, I apologize, I apologize, please. My person. Yeah, thank you. Oh. Hi. Hi. Uh, please do sit. Welcome. How are you? I'm good. I see you're doing very well. Let's go. Little wonder why my father gave you such position of authority in so short a time. You seem to have won the hearts of everyone around here. It's good. Unlike the other one who occupied that position and started acting like he was God. And started acting like he owned the company. Um, men are born of women. All men. But created differently. With different gifts. I need someone to take me out this weekend. Um, I am very, very... Yes, I'm very busy this week. I have a lot of things to clean up. And I have like um, two weddings to attend to, then um, meet up with one or two things. Really? Because I haven't even mentioned your name and you're so quick to turn me down. You know, since I will be taking over my father's position in this company, I think that you're the best person to put me through on how things work around here. So you don't have a choice, sir. You are going to take me out this weekend. <laughs> okay. You have not really decided on who to go with. The moment you decide on any of them, others will just back off. That's the problem you're having. Just my, take my advice. If it is Gina, I believe Steph is much closer. Steph is somebody I know a little bit. She's homely. She can make a good wife. Just go on with her. I don't know why you are wasting time. You know what? Thank God. Vina, sometimes uh, you make me sick. I'm yet to understand all this whole scenario. Thank you, Mr. Advisor. No God bless you. Thank you. They will keep on disturbing you. They will be disturbing you. This one will come. This one will come. But the moment they see that this one has really taken place and this one has really settled that with you, all of, all, all other ones will just back off. I said thank you now. Uh, I'm just trying to address uh, what I said now. Uh, probably you will consider and reconsider what I said. It's alright. You don't need to worry about that. I'm happy for you. But see, Amani, please. I need you to work out something for me. Just tell me what to do so I can win his heart. Please, do it for me. Well, whatever is your proposition, uh, definitely it's going to be a very hard tax. It's not going to be easy for me to begin to talk to Obina about you. Uh, Obina is a man that believes in accuracy. He's a man that believes that 
that things should be done the way it's supposed to be. It's not a man you can force to do something. I don't know how to go about this. Come on, Amani. Not when a fat envelope is involved for you. You don't insult me with that kind of demand. If there is anything you want me to do for you, you can spoon yourself properly and let me find a way to help you, not bringing up envelope. It's okay. I will call you in hour's time. I have something for you. That's okay. No problem. All right. All right. All right, see you later. Maybe it will knock somebody down. What is the problem? What is it? Is it a kind of insult or what? Even if there is any problem, why don't you cool down for me to probably we settle down? This kind of call, I don't like it. Insult you? Why you are the one insulting my intelligence? I gave you a tax to do. Why don't you tell me that Obi is going out with our, our, our boss's daughter? Uh, what's the name? What's the name? Her name? Uh, uh, Rebecca. Why don't you tell me that? What is your problem? Are you high? Are you, joke? Are you joking? Is it, is it, is it marijuana? Is it? Come on, please, please, don't give me that look. Stop it. Why are you behaving as if you don't know? You don't know? Even if I know, would heaven fall? Is it a big problem? Why don't you allow these people to settle down? Even if they want to settle down, allow me to do the whole thing for you. Why are you? I don't, I don't understand you. What is the problem? You don't know. I don't know. Then swear to that. Swear you don't know. Amani. Why will I swear? A complete woman to swear before a woman is it not heresy? Is it not stupidity? For me to swear before you, Joy, 
whether they are going out or not, does it look mature? Does it look reasonable? Amani, please, stop giving me that summon. Do the work I asked you to do or you return my money back. How much, please. Are, how much are we even talking about? What is wrong with you ladies? What is the problem? Impatient? You people don't even have one patient. You can't even say, allow me to do this work. I am on it. I am planning very well so that you can have this young man. I don't know why you're so in a haste. What is wrong with you girls? Just do the work. I will do it. Why don't you give me time? Can I do it? I am on it. I don't know why you are running your mouth, opening your eyes so wide as if we are quarreling. Do the work. That is what I want. Hey, the thing you have to go there. Let me do this work. If people, see, if people see you shouting, it seems as if you gave me a work to become a president of Nigeria. Calm down. Startled me. You really need to be scared because I don't understand. What are you doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? I'm cleaning. Because I don't believe that people from inflation homes like you can do this kind of thing you're doing now. Amani, what do you take me for? Well, I don't know what you mean by that, but where I'm coming from, we actually suffered. We started from the grass. Okay? So, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. And I'm surprised why you have that look on your face. A beautiful lady from a wealthy home, maybe from Donald Trump. Is it possible for them to come to a home like this to begin to dust? That's why I'm surprised. That's why I settled you. I am here to believe myself. You shouldn't be so surprised. Did you ever wonder why my father left me in charge of all his companies in Nigeria? Now I can believe Well, you. that's because my brothers think doing stuff like that is suffering. And I enjoy it. I am here to believe. You have something in it? Oh, my food. Make yourself comfortable. Don't even ask me to take it easy. Mm. I never know you have a wonderful cook. A woman from home. I'm telling you honestly, this is very delicious. In fact, every afternoon I'll be coming here. There's actually more where that came from, so if you need more, I can arrange it. Look at my plate. Almost finished. Just take another one and drop it. finished? I'll tackle this one. You are food, eh? Mmm. Oh, God. God gave me a wonderful wife. Wait, mm. wait, wait, wait. wait. That meat is too big, honey. Bring that meat. We have some height. <laughs> we have it, bros. Enjoy, enjoy. Even the chicken. God gave chicken me a wonderful tuck. wife. Mm. Hey, baby. Thank God, though. I'll tell my friends, the kind of view we have for people from rich home, they should change it. Oh, can you just stop it? Even when I came here, I was surprised when she was dusting, cleaning everything. I was saying, ah, is it possible? Let me give you your money. What? 
Take your money first. Please. Okay, thank you for taking your money. Second is I cannot hurt my friend. He wants to settle down. I don't understand. What, what do you mean by that? Definitely, I know you will not understand. Obina and Rebecca are trying to settle down. They want to be a family. And I will advise you to stay out of their life. And another thing I would want you to do for me is this. Try as much as possible to pass the information out there that they want to settle down. It's going to be a good thing for you. And it's better you put off all these shenanigans, all these problems you have. In fact, I will I'll see you then. Thank you. You should have asked her. Does it mean that I fought her? Anyway, I came to congratulate you over your choice. And the truth is that you made the right choice. Thank you. You're welcome. my parents and they're very happy okay. especially my dad he says that he'll come see us whenever he's chance wow thank god but there's a problem he's asking about your family where you're from and what was your answer I told him that your family is fine. What? Why did you lie? What if they find out? They're not going to find out. Before then, we'll probably have come up with something. Uh, I did not like to lie. Not in this situation. What did you expect me to tell him? I mean, how would you feel if a child comes in and says, Oh, Dad, I want to marry him, but he doesn't know his parents, he doesn't know his family, he doesn't know where he's from. He grew up on the streets. Would it sound okay to you? Maybe you should have told him that I was adopted. Just like I told you the truth and you believed me. That's what I'm saying. It's not going to go down well with him. So, what do we do now? Because I don't want to lose you. Maybe you're not going to lose me and I don't want to lose you too. So don't worry, I'm sure we'll be able to work something out. She's been sending me her pictures, but I think I like this one more. So beautiful. This. Say <laughs> something else, man. Uh, the game is something else, man. I can just stop, you know. What is like your preparation? What are you... Oh, boy, now you didn't ask me this kind of thing. I don't really know because, you know, sometimes when I look at you, I see you from the physical point of view, I see you from the spiritual aspect of... Did you ask her to come? Um, just calm down. Calm down. Why? Calm down, Obina. Just calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Just calm down. I, I asked her to come. And it's for a reason. Why don't you allow her to sit down at least properly? Yeah? Maybe I can make a proper introduction.
There was something we discussed. I told you I'm about settling down. I told you I need to be a man. I told you I need to be a responsible man. I told you I need to be a father. I told you I need to be a man in which you see children running in my house. I told you I need a mother. And this is the mother. Mother of my children. I'm born what? Um, Amani. Yeah, I've been. This is the biggest surprise of the millennium. Tell oh, me you're yes. not joking. Oh, yes. I cannot joke. In fact, you know me to be a man that does not joke with things of responsibility. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on. You see? <laughs> okay. Okay. Everybody, come on, get us let, let us celebrate, man. This is <laughs> wonderful. This is nice. This is. I can't, I can't believe it. You need to believe it. It's up your life. I wish Rebecca is here. Anyway, this calls for celebration. Let me get more drink. I'm coming. Okay, no problem. You come on, sit down. Something knocks them down. Then she used that opportunity to escape. Chai! Thank God. That's very brave of you. This is the second time that I am getting attacked. Ever since we announced our second Have you have you made an entry? Yes, I did. The first time it happened, I did and now. I'm just so scared. Somebody somewhere is not happy. Honestly. We're going to fish out this idiot, this fool, and deal with the person. Why are you panicking? I thought you have the heart of stone. Baby! You frightened me! How did you get into my car? It doesn't matter. I am here to warn you seriously. Stop what you're doing. Else, you find your dead body in town in the street. I don't... I don't, I don't understand. About? Rebecca. Rebecca is what I am talking about. If anything happens to her, I will disgrace you to the world and litter your dead body in the street. Be warned.
honey. My parents actually went to see your parents today. What did you say? Well, I knew of a couple in the town where I did my NYSC. They didn't have kids, and I was very nice to them. In fact, I'm actually building a bungalow for them. And I got them to act as your parents, and they did not object. Why would you do that? Honey, I don't want any stumbling block. Not now, when I've just survived two assassination attempts. All thanks to God, I just don't want any more stress on this. I will go and see them myself. Okay. I'll take you there. I call this strange love. 